And we're back. Hello. And yes. Jengis has declared on the Dutch. Mm-hmm. This just making sure yes, this is where we left off. Um We nicked Rotterdam. Mm-hmm. No, I'm just making sure that this with the what we've set up is like yes. the current state of our army is correct. Which isn't looking too bad. Uh there's a lot of things we need. Hmm. I'd have no idea what to go for here. Well, harbour in Braga would be very helpful. The city connection will be a nice injection of gold. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, we can't go through here. You would get 228. That's acceptable. Very nice. What's the plan with all of these nows um, once they're sort of dealt with? Um. You just keep them around. Okay. They turn into ironclads eventually. Very useful. Mm -hmm. So three cannons should be enough to take pretty much any city at this stage of the game, right? No. No? No. You have to get lucky with the terrain. Cannons are super fragile. Mm. Like, incredibly fragile. Okay. And we're, you're still allied to the Dutch, right? So we're not going to go to war with you just yet. Gonna wait to build that nice, unique tile improvement and then do it. Yeah, because it happens regardless of our diplomatic status with the. Uh... Which is quite fitting for Portugal. Mm -hmm. Although that was the whole point of them being heavily uh, armed outposts in the first place. Hmm. Uh, five. Oh, we're not getting. We're not working any scientist specialists. Made those guys in. That's so That's bad. The food issues in Lisbon are creating a lot of problems. Oh, fine. Now we have to. I don't want to get the backstabber penalty. Hmm. Oh, mm, you were one of their allies, huh? Hmm. At least William has to deal with the war on two fronts. Makes our lives a little bit easier. No, no, and I, I put the Citadel up there earlier in anticipation of this precise thing happening. Mm. And Amsterdam is flat land, so... That's good, at least. And... Mm. Let's see now. We did make sure to build a harbour in Lisbon, right? Yes, we did. Yes. Constructed there. So over to Lhasa? Yeah. Scouting around Karakoram. I would like. Okay, so Highwell mm -hmm. has got himself a um, an army there. Hmm. Maybe. So I need to keep an eye out for that. Yeah, well, he was going to attack Genghis. Yeah. Babylon and India don't get along. Apparently, <laughs> <sighs> Cape Town has prepared on us as well. Hmm. 
Cape Town, one of the ones up here. Where's Cape Town? Oh, up there. Oh, damn it. That's actually going to be a problem. That's really irritating. 210, fine. Whatever. Because you're now at negative 29 gold per turn. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because we lost cargo ships. Uh, let's see, what are we doing? There's a lot of things we need in Lisbon, but there's also a lot of things that... A lighthouse would go a long way to... No, it wouldn't, Bob. Oh no, there's no fish. What, yeah. There is one fish. Ah, uh, so once we get a lighthouse up, that will actually... Decent. Um, hmm. Okay, I can't sail through here without being at war, and you guys, I suppose, will have to just come up and keep an eye to things, and then mm. we'll, we'll get some experience for our units. Quebec City, we could probably get on our side. That would be nice. Well, it's a maritime city-state, so it actually, it really would be nice. Provides a lot of food. Yeah. Um, see, I was going to wait for dynamite. So Lisbon will actually, yeah. It's getting plus nine food. Why is it? It's so long to grow from something that's got a plus nine food surplus. I don't really know that mechanic very well. No, it's just for something with that much of a food surplus, you'd think it would grow faster. It did just gain this turn plus six. Oh yeah, maybe it maybe it hasn't registered yet. So is there any way to know what an enemy city will target within its attack range? The AI will prioritize wounded units or seed. Okay. Uh, uh, wounded units or seed units. Okay. Right, so, you know, Cape Town is, is a problem, so let's see now. Onondaga also provides a decent amount of money, so we'll go there. Brings us up to minus 13, which helps a bit. Well then we'll have we'll have a city connection with Braga in two turns. That uh, provides cash. Incidentally, mm. we're definitely taking Kronikan because. Um, well, look at all those polders. Yeah, we want the polders for ourselves. Also, there doesn't appear to be much defense there. Mm. Let's see now. Uh, we're not even working a lot of specialists. Oh, yes, of course, right, that, yes. What are you going for there? Exploration. Uh, choose host. Let's... Oh, Babylon's going to win it anyway, so let's just... Um, oh, Kyle also wants to embargo city-states. We can't have that. That would end horribly. Well, that costs us money. Hmm. Yeah, so that's... Okay, Cape Town doesn't really have any naval units, so that's nice, at least. Means your trade routes are very safe, at least there. Yeah, now let's see... I can do this, 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 and this, this turn. At 46 strength, that's not going to be an easy take. Well, let's just see how it goes for us. The cannons will help a lot. Okay, we built another Fatoria. I want to point out we are now at plus 14 happiness. Which is huge. We, well, plus 14 happiness for uh, nothing on our part. Except yeah. for just wandering workers around the world. That's Portugal. Uh-huh. Now 
you guys will have to come back and heal up. Do the Dutch have their unique boat yet? Uh, the Dutch have no ports. Oh, they're landlocked now that you took um, Rotterdam. Rotterdam. Excellent. That's a big deal against the Dutch because their unique unit is quite strong. Yeah, and given that all our units are good. Oh, but then at the same time, having them having their unique unit out would also mean I could uh, capture it. True. And I would very much like to be able to like capture the privateers. Hmm. The hoods and beggars. That's a lot of forces coming into uh, oh, Braga. That's not that much. Uh, now you. We need a lot of things here. Um, we we need a lot of things. Uh, an aqueduct, I think, was one of those. I really do need to get aqueducts up everywhere. Um, they help a great deal. Why will it not let me pillage? Oh right, of course, uh, that's in my own that's land. That's your land. That should help to draw fire, and you Chosen. can build. Did you? Now we could do with a lot of things here. Amphitheaters, aqueducts, so forth. Uh, we could also use nows, and actually, <laughs> rather than a musket mat or an aqueduct here, what we need is that's right, cargo ships. We need two cargo ships. Victoria. Although, uh, Lass is pretty garbage and isn't going to be getting us anything we don't already have. But it still helps. Yes. <coughs> that is a lot of Hiawatha Navy. Uh, it's alright. We can take it. We could take it. I'm not sure how Chengis is going to do. It doesn't matter. One or the other, I'm just gonna go to war with them anyway. Yeah. But yeah, ex exploration was actually quite important there. What's the opener for exploration? Plus one movement, plus one sight for all naval combat units. That's very, very nice. <laughs> yeah, it's it's uh, it's the same bonus you get from the Great Lighthouse if I go to sorry, that's the tech tree. So getting both of those yeah. stacks quite ridiculously. Yeah, well, and then if you're you're also playing England, you, mm. you get the um, you get the drawing that I did way back when. Yes. Babylon now likes us a bit more, which is nice. Babylon conquered Delhi. Oh dear. That makes them a bit scary. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Do... This, if this uh, is going to be a conquest game, this might turn into one of since there's a lot of inland capitals that aren't on our continent. This might turn into a sort of uh, slap people around with XCOMs kind of thing. <laughs> It'll at least be entertaining to watch. Right, no, let's see. Okay, you people really, really, really need to get off my trade routes. Mm. Uh, Continue laying siege to Amsterdam. Looks like that'll be done fairly soon. Yeah, uh, next turn should do. That'll be a big, big setback for William, I'd expect. 
Well, of course, it's his capital. Yes. You don't, with Civ, Civ uh, 5, you don't lose your capital. Like, ever. I don't think I could imagine a situation in which you win the game after losing your capital. There are uh, science victory stuff. There is, you can, or you can, if you've, like, set it up well enough, win science mm. or diplo after losing your capital. But you, it requires you to have a science victory already in progress, basically. Yes. And because you're on building part, the last parts you need in places other than your capital. Mm. And then what becomes your new capital, your previously added spaceship parts don't get destroyed when you lose your capital. I mean, that's nice at least. Well, it's nice for the... It's nice for the person who's going science. It's not so nice for the anyone who's... Uh, Trying to stop it. Yeah. Okay, William made peace with Genghis. Didn't lose anything. Well, he's about to. Excellent. I get a feeling I probably would have had a lot more... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, great works captured if I hadn't uh, if I had built more culture buildings myself as is they probably got Wasted. a lot of great works uh, well they're in the Uffizi so mm. no let's see oh, we won't oh, make peace yet let's lost the will to fight is the I'm not going to make peace with you yet, thing. Mm. Fuck off. My horse. It does seem like there's a lot of people going at least a heavily diplomatic route. Oh, the AI's always doing cities from you. Okay, he's, he's not even bothering with that, uh, with, with Lake Simcoe, which is one of Hiawatha's cities that Cenk has captured, I want to point out. Yes. He, he's just marching straight to. Right, okay. Utrecht and Breda aren't really very useful to us. They don't give us any new resources. It's just uh, from the we want for the polders. So, take Utrecht and burn it to the ground? Eh. If William will make peace with us, he can, he can... He can keep his tiny, tiny cities. Well, it's just that he can be useful for, like... Well, actually, not really useful for trading, because none of them are coastal, but... Well, right now, he's, right now, he's more experienced fodder than anything else. That's always nice. Especially on the cannons, getting... Those uh, siege upgrades are really, really nice. Yes, right. Now, you can. Well, it's a bit late now to build your aqueduct, honestly. It'll still help, I'd expect. Yeah, well, actually, no, I need another unit. Build, uh. Yeah, build another musk now. And then we'll have to maybe see about getting more. You go to Rotterdam, heal up, then these cannons we're going to have to start marching down to. I don't know how. It's annoying that we lost, that uh, he won't make peace now, because that means we can't set up a trade route. Antwerp, and Antwerp was by far our most Your best trade route. Oh, yes. oh, you ah. will? Ah, okay. Well, you know what, I'm not even going to worry about following him. I mean, he can keep it for now. Yeah. 
lets us focus more on Chengus. Who is also a valuable trading buddy. But at the same time, he's getting his capital siege down hardcore. And you know what? I want to snipe it. Okay, Lisbon getting 18 food per turn. Uh, yeah, you see, Karakorum, Karakorum's a valuable trade route. Right? But we do want to take his city states back. So let's just see. Second. Let's see what happened. Fuck off. <laughs> Let's see if I can't see what damage was done to it, if any. Uh, you could move that spare spy you I, have. There. I think he's gone. And oh, we've got yeah, we got a new spy. Uh, I think uh, Hiawatha maybe isn't using his uh, army very effectively. Okay, right, Lisbon needs a lot of things. Needs the. Okay, given how slow it's going, it desperately needs the ironworks. See, again, Antwerp. Actually, well, Zanzibar and I is also acceptable. But, uh, Zanzibar seems favorite. excellent. So we're making 36 gold per turn now. Which means I think we could offset the cost of losing the trade route to Chengus. Yes. Uh, it's just I want to be I want to be careful. I have to make sure that it's. I have to make sure that it's taking damage. Mm. Otherwise, it's not going to do me much good. And uh, this land army here, actually, now you're going to have to turn around again. Turn around and move up. Through all that jungle. Yeah. Hmm. Almaty does seem sort of reasonably easy to attack, though. Yeah. I'll probably have to get a worker out. Right. Build me a worker. We're going to have to build a road through that jungle. Just so we can get reinforcements up. Yeah. Oh, 51 combat strength. You know what? That might have to wait to artillery. Mm. We'll have that reasonably soon, though. What? 10? 12 turns? Oh! Wow. Okay. That I didn't see coming. Okay, and again, Washington. Hiawatha has no idea how to actually use his army. So Washington has his unique unit. What exactly does that do? Oh, it's been souped up since the old days. Mhm. Mm it, it, no, it, it, it's a musket man that ignores terrain cost. Okay, that's huge. And can um, it ignores terrain cost and gives you golden age points for kills. That's a big deal. Mhm. Mm no, don't worry, we'll manage. You Warf might want to pull the cannon up from Rotterdam. Warfare in Civ Six is a heavily defensively focused affair. Mhm. Mm it 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 heavily fear provided you take adequate precautions, of course. It uh, heavily favours the defender. Okay. This could be a nice chance to take Washington, though. Yeah, again, artillery. Hmm. How far away from are we? Uh, that far. A while. And it means delaying a lot of other things, but we'll still do it anyway. And Raga, you can just uh, you know keep just keep 
building now is because I can get a lot of money from them. But, um, no, no, maybe we should bring it to private gears, maybe. We do need more of those. Okay, right, for fuck's sake, Hiawatha. What's he done now? Hit the, hit the fucking city! God damn it. The AIs are not amazing at naval warfare, it seems. No, no, that's it's a known issue. The AI will never move a boat and then shoot. Really? Yes. That seems like a fairly simple thing. They will only they will only ever use their their boat's uh, attack action uh, on the on the first movement. Okay. Incidentally, Amsterdam has a manufactory there, which is interesting. Uh, William Byrne, a great engineer. Is it normally better to go for the manufactory than a? Uh, no, rush? usually, usually you want usually want to just grab a wonder. Because the wonder can make a big deal later on in the game. Mm -hmm. Or has a bonus. Uh, we'll just citadel up. I love a lot. Got a nice dent in his little red wagon. Mm. Uh, that 30 damage for turn can make a very big deal. Oh yeah, and it's on a hill there and everything I've got. It's just, uh, Washington does have a considerably uh, more potent... Um, yeah, uh, Genghis attacked my unit then, instead of... Okay. Pull back. Now, Hiawatha, the city, please. <laughs> Yeah, that's... Uh... Once those bone gets there, The ironworks will make a very, very big difference. <laughs> Yeah, well, Lisbon is such a lackluster capital. Mm. Was there any way you could have settled it around there to make a better one? No, it's just crap land. Fair. It's not good land for build for for uh, building a capital on. Mm. Three turns we have fertilizer though, which will give us an extra. Uh, plantation food yield. Pasture It'll make a food big yield. Difference. So that's plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven food in Lisbon. That's pretty huge. Yeah. It'd be very nice to get some specialists going in Lisbon. It really would. And... So you will just leave you there as you are. Suleiman doesn't want to pay us full price anymore. Will he swap luxury? No, he won't. Right. Everyone's recognizing, starting to recognize that we're a bit stab happy. Yeah, you see, Washington has actually built himself up. An army with, mm -hmm. like, notable size. Uh, Porto. Right. Definitely need that musketman now. Back to Karakorum. Uh, again! No attack on the city itself.
for how much damage can we do? Okay, we can do a lot more damage versus late Simcoe. So once I get the money together to get uh, money or the experienced mm -hmm. units up around there, I can... Uh, get some... Capture Lick Simcoe at least. 